Throughout this road trip, we've realized we've been doing a lot of complaining about one thing. Traffic. Way too much traffic. Terrible traffic. This traffic is horrible. Traffic, traffic, traffic. Traffic. But this week is all about new words. Apache. New experiences. The most beautiful walk we've done in Florida. And gators. And there's an alligator. <laughs> I don't know what these are. I was looking for the gators. They're right there. Same plan, different day. And we somehow wind up back on the beach. Where do we go from? Where do we go from here? Okay, this is ridiculous. It's a Tuesday, 2.30 in the afternoon. It's not a holiday. This traffic is horrible. And surprise, surprise, that guy that cut in front of us just ran the red light big time. Oh well, may they be in a hurry and get to where they're going. All the best. We made it over the bridge and we are driving through Fort Myers Beach and heading south all the way down along here and then we'll cut over about the time we get to Naples and see if there's any little beach communities around here that stick out to us. It's very cute, but absolutely no barking whatsoever. And happened to get over that bridge and traffic every time you wanted to leave the island. Get old fast. Yeah. Town, but definitely terrible traffic yeah. as we're finding all of these little places that are you know with the one road through them probably not traffic that we'd like to deal with on a daily basis the search continues <laughs> Well, we made it to Naples, our final stop on our quest to find our future home. It's been going pretty well. Yeah, it's been beautiful. I think Naples, even though we haven't videoed any of it, is our favorite place we've been along the Gulf Coast. I think so. Siesta Key was a top competitor as well. Its beaches were beautiful. It just had way too much traffic for us. Cute little village, but that was a recurring theme all the way down the Gulf Coast was out near the beach areas it's one usually one bridge goes over and the traffic even on off days is horrendous which might not be an issue for you but it is for us so we don't want to be somewhere where it's a pain to go anywhere else we can tell you after our tour our top place to live is miami beach definitely and i think it's cheaper than naples I believe you're right. Now we're gonna check out the sites along Alligator Alley on the way back to Miami. Me. Oh. You really need to pay attention. That was right here and we were just talking and looking at the sign saying caution. I said, uh, look down. And there's an alligator. Well, you definitely got to see yourself a gator. We're at the, oh heck, there's a sign up here. You sure you don't wanna try and say that word? <laughs> they say stay six feet away from the water, but they put the sign right next to the water. It's like a test. Look are giant old cypress trees. Wow. Is blood red. Reminds me of aliens. It's a strangling pig. Well, 
Kate definitely gets a winner for picking this one. This is the most beautiful walk we've done in Florida, I think. Yeah, we've seen so many different birds. And we've heard a lot of things jumping into the water or walking around the water, but we haven't been able to see them. <laughs> and a big old gator. Yes, that gator was big. That's awesome. Well done, honey. Why, thank you. So the name that was on the sign, I don't remember, Big Cypress Walk thing, definitely worth it. And it's free. There's not a lot of parking here, and I think that's a really good thing because the only downside to the walk we did yesterday was there's just so many people out there. Yeah, we've only seen probably about 10. The whole walk is about a mile and a half. Watch your step on the boardwalk. It's pretty well maintained, but there are definitely some holes. And yes, I did change my shirt into my hiking shirt. That is poison ivy. And so is that. And all that. Leaves of three, let it be. So when we walked in, you might have been like, oh, that big old gator laying there by that sign was fake. Well, he's gone now. <laughs> he's in there somewhere. And that is why we don't mess with gators. Not sure if you can see it on cam. But our buddy is right about there again, just floated out from under the mangroves and he's just looking at us. Where's the next stop? Okeechobee Post Office. And now is this an addendum to your big cardboard map? Yes. How, how exactly does that one go on there? Here's Naples. Miami's here. It goes right over here. So that's like one of those call out boxes. It's like, yeah. boo, huh? Very nice. Well, with technology like this, how can we go wrong? <laughs> This is the smallest post office in the United States. And they are not kidding. That's it. One dollar, one postcard. Pleasure doing business with you, sir. A postcard from the smallest post office in the US. Oh, now the hard part. What do we say? Did you borrow a pin? Well, we got one. Oh, thanks. Thank, thank you. you though. Start out, dear mom. <laughs> thank you very much. Or do we put it in the box? So well, that was a fun stop. Where's your next, my lovely lady? Next stop is Big Cypress Oasis Visitor Center. Wow. There's supposed to be lots of crops there. Or games, I should say. And trucks. Oh, sure. I was looking for the gators. They're right there. <laughs> <laughs> and there were a lot of them here. Well, we picked quite a day to go to the beach. We were coming up to check out Hollywood Beach and just give this place a shot. I don't think we're going to uh, want to swim to the beach. <laughs> <laughs> but it is 70-something uh, degrees. Yeah, it's like 77. Can't beat that. And we're in a car, so who cares? And this is lighter than it was raining for a long time. Same plan, different day, much better results. <laughs> much. Switch beaches too. We're back down on Sunny Isles Beach because it's our second favorite to South Beach. And Miami Beach is $20 a day. We found it. A little place that you could go for free parking. <laughs> we discovered it when we were staying here for a month. Local tips. Loved Miami, but it's time to go to the airport. The shuttle's downstairs, bags are packed. Yeah, you forget something. <laughs> Check in with the breeze. Oh. This is flat, it's definitely worth it. Oh, yeah, we haven't told you where we're going. Next stop. Keep drinking these coffee. <laughs> Leave the thumbs up and subscribe. Oh, no, that was good. That was good. That was good. <laughs>